Do not try this at home. Smoke point of acetylene is very high and you could get seriously injured. Today, along with the Mad Science Channel creator, we've decided to run experiments with carbide. We've prepared our carbide. Look at the balloons. They are huge. This is calcium carbide. It gives off very explosive gas called acetylene when it comes into contact with water. It starts hissing when it rains. Can you see it? It is heating up, isn't it? <laughs> Let us light it up. It is a cool thing. Look at how it's burning. Splash it. Let us inflate the balloon with acetylene and see what will happen. Guys, since our balloons are quite big, we need to inflate them in a special way. Our first acetylene inflators were not very good. But we liked our test launching. So we decided to make a more powerful explosion. So we have two 5-liter bottles, there is water and calcium carbide in one bottle that produces explosive gas called acetylene and it comes into contact with the water. It is very explosive gas, the other bottle condenses water and only acetylene inflates the balloon. Cool! Here is such a mega balloon we've got. Not everybody likes our experiments. We do not have enough carbide to fully inflate the last balloon. So let us inflate it with air. As a part of our experiment, we've hung the plastic bottle next to the balloons. These balloons are inflated with acetylene, that is why they will explode really loudly. We will light them up with a spear. Look at how huge they are! Shoot this smoke right on camera. Whoa! You can't even imagine how huge it is. It was about 7 meters away, but still I could feel the enormous heat. It was really cool. Can you imagine what the temperature had to be like to turn the bottle into this? It's terrific. Do you see the sparks? It is a thick burning wire that was secured to the balloon. The explosion went fine. If you like the video, then do not litter when you spend time outdoors, please. Take the wire with us. Okay.